Uh, Why are you touching me? I will give this to him that you've dropped off, and I'll let him know that you stopped by. Thank okay. you. Thank you. She had the paper in front of my face, and then she was touching me. I don't appreciate that. You know, if I'd done that to her, I'd be charged with assault. October 20th, 2012, we're at the county attorney's office. After we serve the sheriff the same thing. So. Okay, what are we serving? A demand for data on a fog line traffic stop on Highway 29 North. Okay, and didn't you call the sheriff's department earlier asking for this information? Or yes. confirming the, if it was still there? Yes. Okay. And then you received a call back from whom? Darnell. Okay. And what did she... What did she Dar stated that Todd Roth denied my request for the data. Before, on... before he even submitted it? Yes. Okay. And what does it say on the form there about... It says a spoilator of evidence in a legal action is an individual who neglects to produce evidence that is in her possession or control. In such a situation, any inferences that might be drawn against the party are permitted, and the withholding of the evidence is attributed to the person's presumed knowledge that it would have served to operate against her. That's the definition of spoilation. Okay. So, obviously, they're withholding evidence that uh, is incriminating, right? Correct. Okay. So, Otherwise, they'd have no reason to give it. They'd just give it to me. Right. They'd be happy to show it to yeah. you. Say, here, you were doing something wrong. Yes. But as far as you're concerned, it was... Harassment, retaliation for all the uh, documents I served yesterday in Grant County that is directly related to Polk County. Okay. And also I served in Douglas County. Okay. At the police department there. Yes. In a criminal case you had filed... Against Bremer Bank and... Lakes Area Appraisals and Bacchus Appraisals. Okay, and the Alexander Police said where they were going to forward the information to where? Neil Nelson. Okay. Haven't heard a word for over three weeks. Okay, I think it was like on the 26th of and October. And whenever I've experienced anything with uh, um, criminal evidence being brought to the county attorney, they are charged with a criminal charge immediately afterwards. Okay. Alrighty, so we're going to go hand this information off then. Yes. Okay, let's go. And they're looking yeah. inside. Good. Then they're ready. It's a request for the data on a dash cam video. Dash cam video of fog line traffic stop on 11 19 2012 of Kathleen Barbara Mayer. Okay, I will give it to him. And uh, thanks. She had received information from a uh, Darnell. You don't need to be doing that in here. Darnell, that uh, sh the Todd Roth is going to deny her this information before she even submitted the information. Okay, well, go ahead and I will have him. Why are you touching me? I will give this to him that you've dropped off, and I'll let him know that you stopped by. Thank okay. you. Thank you. She had the paper in front of my face, and then she was touching me. I don't appreciate that. You know, if I'd done that to her, I'd be charged with assault.
you touching me? I will give this to him that you've dropped off, and I'll let him know that you said that. Thank okay. you. Thank you. She had the paper in front of my face, and that she's touching me. I appreciate that. You know, if I'd done that to her, I'd be charged with assault.